what's up guys how you doing <clears throat> so today um i have four appointments lined up with the va hospital uh but before i continue uh do me a favor subscribe to the channel um share the channel with other veterans have them subscribe um and please do comment share your experiences with the va um what you've encountered uh, and what's been able to help you out uh get through the tough times or even getting rated you know what obstacles you guys overcome uh while at the va um so today i have four appointments uh two of them which i am excited about um and after this uh i got other things to do but um one of the appointments is in regards to uh, meeting up with uh, disabled American veterans, um, which I am a member of. And if you're not a member, become a member. Um, and if you don't like DAV, go with American Legion or any other organizations you feel that would be helpful or useful to you. Um, so DAV today, uh, my main concern is Asking them how they could help me out um, getting to permanent total and confirming um, to see if I have to, you know, how to go about writing the letter um, to request, well, writing the letter to the regional office to request um, a permanent total um, and how to go about that and what else do I need in regards to that. Um, whatever information they share, I'll make sure to share with you guys. Um, and obviously, I'll uh, I'll document that uh, that process uh, and see if I get there. I know that uh, one thing, if I were to, um, well, I'm assuming that if I were to apply for permanent total, that would put every other rating that I have or every other service connection that I have, um, you know, to be seen again, you know, um, and be reevaluated. So, I'm a good thing I'm still going to my appointments. Um, so hopefully it doesn't affect it much. Uh, so we'll see what happens. But um, yeah, so, you know, uh, hopefully, you know, uh, today will be a good day. Um, four appointments in one shot, you know, like I said before um, in one of my other videos in regards to, you know, the tricks to VA appointments. You got to line them up, line them all up because I don't have time, you know, um, to be driving, you know, driving or taking transportation in order to come to uh, two appointments all the time. You know, it takes away from your day or other things you might be able to do, you know. So, um, you know, last time around, I I had an appointment where I could have missed that. I could have missed out on it, but I, I had to cancel other things, you know, so kind of sucks sometimes so i try to line them up all at once um and hopefully um i'll be able to get in one more appointment today um we'll see what happens i'll be able to um to take care of that uh if you have a psychologist psychiatrist or a therapist or however you know um you can do a skype uh appointment so talk to the VA. Um, that is one of one of the benefits that I missed out in stating yesterday. Um, you can uh, request an iPad. Um, well, well, what happens is, so your whoever your provider is, they'll get you um, an iPad, and uh, it'll be, you know, obviously it's it's for you uh, for you to use. But um, if you have an appointment, and you're unable to make it in person. You state that to your provider, and your provider will be able to Skype you, and you'll be able to uh, explain what it, whatever it is that's going on with you. Um, so, look into that. Um, there's a great way. Um, sometimes I don't even need to travel to the VA, um, but um, for today I physically have to be here. Um, and with the DAV one, I'm very excited to hearing what the outcome, what the answer would be and uh, how this whole process, what the outcome would be. Um, so stay tuned um, and do me a, fa a favor again, subscribe to the channel uh, and uh, like and comments, you know, and hit the alert button, you know, for the notifications for more videos. All right, guys, take care. Bye-bye.